show me your hands. Ooh, everybody wants to hear the story. So let's start. The title of the story is Johnny and Mr. Garrett. Does anybody know who is Johnny? No, let's meet Johnny. Hello everyone, I am Johnny. So he is Johnny and Johnny was a very, very naughty boy. And he had a cute little sister named Mary. So Johnny and Mary both loved eating junk food. Who knows what is junk food? I'll tell you. This is pizza. What is this? Burger. So pizza, burger, noodles, pasta, all these foods are known as junk food. And Johnny and Mary both loved eating junk food. So one day at lunchtime, somebody came to meet them. You all know who? Come on, let's see. Mr. Carrot. Mr. Carrot came to meet Johnny and Mary. And he asked both of them, Hello, Johnny and Mary. I am Mr. Carrot. Hello, Mr. Carrot. What happened? Johnny, why don't you eat me and my other friends? Mr. Carrot, I think you taste very yucky. But this pizza tastes very yummy. No, Johnny, you're wrong. I am very tasty too. I make you healthy and strong. Listening to this, Mary promised Mr. Carrot that she would eat all the vegetables. But Johnny kept eating pizza. So after a few days at dinner time, something happened. Come on, let's see what happened. So at dinner time, Johnny's stomach started paining. Where is your stomach, students? Come on, show me. Yes, this is your stomach. And Johnny was shouting in pain. Oh, somebody help me. My stomach is paining. Listening to this, Mr. Carrot ran to Johnny and told him, Quick, Johnny, pick me up and eat me. I will help you fight the pain. So Johnny quickly ate Mr. Carrot and Mr. Carrot went inside the stomach of Johnny. What did he see inside the stomach? All the junk food were fighting with each other. So Mr. Carrot told everyone, Stop everyone, we should not fight. Fighting is bad and love is good. So, listening to Mr. Carrot, all the junk food stopped fighting and Johnny started feeling better. So, Johnny promised Mr. Carrot, Mr. Carrot, I promise you that I will eat all the vegetables and stay healthy. So, kids, what do you learn from the story? That we should always eat healthy food to stay healthy and strong. And we should also listen to our elders.